Hello, I'm Mark Goldbridge from the United Stand and here is another top five for you. The January transfer window may well be over, but who's looking for a bargain? Because in the summer of 2018, we've got for you the top five free agents this summer that your club may want to take a little bit of a gamble on. We're going to start off with Fernando Torres. Remember when he used to light the Premier League up for Liverpool and then they cashed in for £50 million and he did next to nothing at Chelsea. Back at, at, at where it all began, at Atletico Madrid, 33 years of age and available for free in the summer. Already being linked to Newcastle. Would your club fancy a bit of Torres? Certainly not the player he was in, the, in his Atletico Madrid and Liverpool prime, but still a striker that, you know, plays at a decent level. Uh, very experienced. What's he got left in the tank? Would you take a punt on Fernando Torres? 33 years of age. He is free in the summer. Uh, who else have we got for you? Who else have we got for you? Who else? Uh, well, we've definitely got Marion Fellaini for you. I mean, as a Manchester United fan, you can gladly take him for nothing. But he is out of contract. He's ran his contract down. He's a contract rebel at Manchester United. He'll turn 31 in November. So he's 30. So plenty, 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 plenty of petrol left in the tank. I'm trying to sell him for you. Come on. Look, here we go. But um, Mourinho is begging him to stay. Mourinho is desperate for him to stay at Manchester United. They're quite opposite to many Manchester United fans. But... If you are a club that likes long ball, no, I'm only joking. No, no, well, not really. If you are a club that likes a big player who likes long balls and likes to put his elbows about and get stuck in, then Fellaini's the man for you. Linked to Turkey is free. You know what? In all fairness, all, all joking apart, if you're a West Ham fan, Moyes would love him. But um, Fellaini's up for grabs. And at 30 years of age, for what he brings, it, yeah. what's Fellaini's strength? I'll tell you what. With Pamela Anderson, he's got the best chest in the world. His chest control is superb. Um, and, he, and that's what he brings to a team. If you want to, The thing I'd always say about Fellaini very quickly is that United bought him. And when he was at Everton, he was very good. Because he played off the striker. who's was a number 10. Leighton Baines, arrowing 40-yard balls forward to him. He controls it on the edge of the box. And you're on the attack. United decided to play him under three managers as a centre defensive midfielder. Which he ain't. So for anybody out there who fancies a number 10 that can you can hit from the, your own half and uh, they're going to magnet it on the edge of the opposition box and bring others into the play, I think that's Fellaini's best position. Weirdly, he thinks he's a midfielder as well. But if you fancy a number 10 who's going to hold the ball up uh, from a long ball, then uh, Fellaini is your man and he's free this summer. Take him. Uh, next up, we've got these two. These two, Robin and Ribéry, are available from Bayern Munich uh, and both are free this summer. What? I mean, I'm intrigued by this. Of course, I would love either. But what I hadn't realised is they're both 34. Both free. Uh, will both go to the MLS, as some have predicted? Or do you think Do you think at 34 that one of these or both of these could still do a job for some of the top clubs in European football? I, You know what? I think they could. I think Robin is a player that, um, that you know, keeps himself very, very fit. And Ribéry... I think I think that they, at 34 years of age, when you think about Zlatan came to the Premier League at 35, I think these guys, um, especially when you think as well, I mean, I know football's changed a lot, but I remember Peter Beardsley, Ryan Giggs playing well into their late 30s in the Premier League. And these are players that are, you know, you can play them as a number 10, you can play them out wide. It's their technique you're after. Yeah, they're going to lose a bit of pace, but it's their technique you want. And I think it's intriguing that two players of that quality are available. Would Arsenal fancy it? Would an Arsenal fan fancy it? Liverpool fan? United fan? Chelsea fan? Would you fancy one of those at your club for free in the summer? I don't know why I've gone high-pitched. Um, I think it's an interesting one with those two, and uh, I'll be intrigued to see where they go next. Free this summer. Um, Omre Khan, or Emre Khan, uh, he's a little bit younger. 10 years younger, in fact. 24 years of age. Um, feels he can do better. Doesn't want to sign a new contract at Liverpool. Obviously doesn't buy into the Klopp revolution that uh, is not never going to happen, it seems. But uh, Liverpool are on the up at the moment. Very good attack. They need to sort their defence out. They've signed Van Dijk. Maybe they need uh, another midfielder. They've got Naby Keita coming in. So Can should be thinking, well, this team could get better and better. Maybe, they, maybe Liverpool finally are going uh, to turn a corner. But Can doesn't really seem to think so. Link to Juventus. Um, strangely linked to Manchester United that will never happen Liverpool to United but he's available for free and I can imagine there's quite a lot of clubs that would quite fancy him would your club fancy him but free this summer Emery can and finally here he is Balotelli played for every club in England it seems Man City Liverpool um where else has he played 
I'm sure he's played for more than two. My main, my, my main's gone blank, so it has. But um, AC Milan, Inter Milan, uh, he's playing in France at the moment. This guy's still only 27 years of age. Of course, he's the fire starter, uh, twisted fire starter. Um, bit of pro bit of prodigy there. Um, you know what? I think I don't know what you think about your football, but I do think about my football like this, and I just you know I. Clearly, nobody can tame Balotelli because he's been to, been at so many clubs and it's not worked out. But I still think there'll be a manager out there that think that they can. Free, free in the summer. So I think his agent is Mini Riola, who United fans will know all about, likes a good deal. And uh, no doubt he'll be taking a big piece of the pie in the summer again as Balotelli finds a club. There, there'll be somebody who wants to take him on. Um, decent talent and clearly hasn't fulfilled that talent, but I still think he can... He can offer something to some decent sides. I don't think any top club is going to go near him with a barge pole, but you could see certain clubs maybe fancying him in the summer. Um, Balotelli is is my number one out of the five. I think for his age, the talent he is. I mean, Amre, to be fair, Amre can pushes him quite close. And Ro I still think Ribery, Ribery and Robin are Robin are very very good as well. Um, notable others: uh, Cialini from Juventus. Uh, he's free in the summer as well. Um, good centre back. So. There's some good players about. We we lost a few in January. So Alexis Sanchez would have been one. Went to United. Ozil signed a new contract. Goretzka's uh, um, secured his move to Bayern Munich. But uh, there's plenty of others out there. But they're the top five for me at the moment. Get commenting below. Would you take any or all or some of them? Uh, give us your thoughts. Get commenting below. Thanks for watching. And make sure you subscribe to the channel and keep getting involved. Thanks for watching.